So following on from my um, DMX display uh, device uh, video, I thought I'd just mention how I'm using um, a different USART for DMX reception on the Arduino Mega. Um, so it's all to do with the uh, with the basically it's all to do with the registers and changing the names of the registers. So um, in the, the the Uno version, we had in the uh, interrupt subroutine, we just had USART um, RX vector. So in in or for the Mega, we need to number those zero, one, two, three, which is the the four different um, USARTs on the Mega. And then we also need to change this bit here, this number here. So that becomes zero, one. Well, it was zero for the Uno, and it's zero, one, two, or three for the Mega. The same for this, and the same for this also. So these three, these three uh, registers or bits or the data, they need to be correctly referenced for the, the USART you're using, and also you need to have the right USART control um, in in the interrupt subroutine. Um, the only other thing you need to watch out for is your serial begin. So on the Mega, the serial begin is for USART 0, and then serial 1, serial 2, and serial 3 are for the 2nd, 3rd, and 4th USARTs. Um, I took a little while to figure out what I was doing wrong, because I couldn't couldn't get any DMX on, on the second one, but I knew I was using the right registers. So uh, that was a little bit of a trap. Do that. Uh, the other thing to watch out for is in the hardware serial.cpp um, code um, is there is if you commented out just the first USART um, previously, you need to extend that. Basically, we're replacing either one. So we're replacing 0, 1, 2, or 3, uh, depending on which one you want for DMX. So potentially, I haven't tested this, but potentially it's possible to have 1 for DMX and 1 for serial, but um, that's a, a test for another day.